Barbara L. F. Fredrickson, Positivity, Groundbreaking Research Reveals How to Embrace the Hidden Strength of Positive Emotions, Overcome Negativity, and Thrive. Welcome to the summary of Positivity. Groundbreaking research reveals how to embrace the hidden strength of positive emotions, overcome negativity, and thrive by Barbara L. Fredrickson. This book dives into the often overlooked power of positive emotions and how they can transform our lives. By learning the importance of cultivating positive emotions and achieving an optimal positivity ratio, you'll be able to experience life with a more positive outlook, ultimately leading to increased resilience, successful relationships, and overall happiness. The summary uncovers the hidden benefits of positive emotions, discusses the right ratio of positive to negative emotions, and provides methods to increase positivity in your life. The Bright Side of Emotions The impact of positive emotions has been overlooked in the past, but recent research shows that they can have a great effect on our day-to-day -day existence. While negative feelings have been crucial to our survival, positive emotions such as love, joy, gratefulness, hope or pride, often go unnoticed, yet they make us more resilient and help guide us through many tough times. Positive psychologists have shown that if you increase the amount of positive emotions you experience, you'll reap many benefits such as being more successful in your career, enjoying more stable and fulfilling relationships, and living a generally happier, less stressful life. Positive Emotions for a Happy Life We are all born with the main ingredient for a happy life, positive emotions. However, not all of us experience enough of them naturally to remain positive in challenging situations. Those who experience predominantly positive emotions have a positive attitude toward life, making them resilient and successful. Optimism helps them overcome mental health issues and navigate through tough times. It also helps them form healthier relationships and have successful social and professional lives. To lead a happy life, one should consciously increase the amount of positive emotions they experience. Studies show that exposure to small positive stimuli such as pleasant images or sounds can increase positive emotions rapidly. The more positive emotions we experience, the more positive our general outlook on life becomes. Therefore, anyone can aim for a positive attitude by increasing the amount of positive emotions they experience consciously. The Transformative Power of Joy and Positive Emotions When we experience positive emotions such as joy, our perspective broadens, and our sense of play is awakened, propelling us into unexplored territory. This power of positive emotions can even change our personality, making us more tolerant and accepting towards others. Positive emotions, particularly joy, have a remarkable capacity to energize us, expanding our possibilities for creative thought and problem-solving. Research shows that positive emotions make us more likely to play, which in turn enhances creativity and problem-solving abilities. Even across species, such as Hussar monkeys, playful activities boost their life-saving skills in escaping dangerous predators. For humans, positive emotions unlock our perception, transforming the way we view the world. Long-term exposure to positive emotions like joy has profound impacts on personality and character, making individuals more compassionate and accepting of others, as demonstrated in cross-cultural studies. Positive emotions also effectively consolidate human relationships, promoting a sense of togetherness amongst individuals. Furthermore, Research suggests that positive emotions affect our focus, enabling us to perceive more details, including those at the margins, thereby expanding our vision. In essence, the transformative power of joy and other positive emotions has far-reaching implications for individual well-being, creativity, and even human relationships. Attaining happiness through a proper positivity ratio the importance of balance between positive and negative emotions in achieving happiness is discussed in this book. Studies show that negative emotions carry more weight than positive emotions in our lives, causing an imbalance in our emotion ratio and leading to a downward spiral of unhappiness. However, by increasing the number of positive emotions we feel for every negative one, we can achieve a positivity ratio of 3 to 1 and experience an upward spiral towards more happiness. 
Unfortunately, most people have a positivity ratio of 2 to 1 or less and are dissatisfied with their lives. A study conducted on a group of people recording their feelings over a long period of time showed that those with a higher positivity ratio were happier in general. Achieving a balanced positivity ratio is essential for a healthy mental state and a happier life. Cultivating Resilience for a Positive Life According to the book, the ratio of positive to negative emotions is genetically influenced, but it doesn't mean we can't change it. The framework can be navigated, and by developing new habits that make us feel good, regularly reminding ourselves of our accomplishments, and writing a letter of gratitude to someone, we can cultivate positive emotions. Cultivating resilience, or the ability to deal with adversities, is valuable in increasing happiness overall. The goal is not to get rid of negative emotions but to overshadow them with positive emotions. It's essential to find techniques that work for us as individuals and make them into habits that start an upward spiral of growth and happiness. Self-knowledge and happiness The link between self-knowledge and happiness has been observed by philosophers for years. If you want to increase your positivity ratio, start by observing your behavior and documenting what makes you feel good. By keeping track of situations that trigger positive and negative emotions, you can increase your positivity ratio. A gratitude diary is a tried and tested technique that can help you trigger positive emotions more often. By finding out which situations make you grateful, you can recreate those experiences and boost your overall attitude towards life. A collection of positive memories like a photo album or a memorabilia box can also serve as great emotion boosters. By looking through these positive memories, you can experience those good feelings again. Mindfulness, the art of living. Mindfulness is the practice of being present and enjoying every moment of life by focusing on the positive aspects of everything experienced. This can be achieved by being aware of negative feelings and questioning their relevance. Mindfulness helps dissipate negative emotions, reducing the likelihood of exaggerated reactions to unimportant events. Distracting oneself from negative experiences and re-evaluating the negative to find something positive in it are also strategies for achieving mindfulness. Mindfulness broadens the perspective of individuals to achieve significant personal growth in their lives. Harnessing Positivity with Meditation Meditation has been proven to increase mindfulness and improve a positive attitude towards life. It can help reach the 3 to 1 positivity ratio and has shown to reduce pain, stress, and anxiety. Regular meditation practice can lead to physical changes in the brain and increase happiness with just 5 minutes a day. Changing habits may seem easy, but it often takes strong willpower or proven techniques to make permanent change. One such technique is meditation, an ancient Buddhist practice that has been adopted by the West. Meditation aims to improve the spirit and soul by focusing on the present moment and increasing mindfulness, a key step towards a positive attitude to life. Studies have shown that meditation helps individuals slow down, live in the moment, and become more aware of positive moments in life. One study separated two groups of test subjects, those who participated in a meditation workshop and those who didn't, revealing the workshop participants had a significantly higher positivity ratio. Beyond positivity, research has also found that meditation reduces pain, stress, and anxiety, and physical changes in the brain support these findings. For those serious about attaining a 3 to 1 positivity ratio, regular meditation practice can be a helpful tool. Practicing meditation for as little as 5 minutes a day can increase happiness and overall quality of life. In conclusion, Positivity by Barbara L. Fredrickson emphasizes the importance of focusing on positive emotions and experiences to achieve a fulfilled and happy life. Through understanding the benefits of cultivating positive emotions, and the significance of maintaining an optimal positivity ratio, you can begin to incorporate techniques such as gratitude diaries, mindfulness, and meditation into your daily routine. By consciously increasing your number of positive experiences and emotions, you can overcome negativity, build resilience, and enhance your overall well-being. Remember, happiness is not just a fleeting emotion, but a byproduct of practicing positivity consistently.